In round two, start with three chain stitches, then work 12 double crochet increases, finally end with one slip stitch. Work three chain stitches first. Yarn one hook, pull the yarn through the loop on the hook. That's one chain stitch. Work two more chain stitches. Okay, the chain stitches are not counted into the number of stitches. Double crochet increase means working two double crochets in the same stitch. Yarn one hook, insert hook into the first stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up loop. There are three loops on hook now. Yarn one hook, pull through the first two loops on hook. Yarn one hook again, pull through the remaining two loops on hook. One double crochet is done. Place a marker in the first stitch. Through the underneath of the two loops of the V shape. Then work one more double crochet in the same stitch. Yarn one hook, insert hook into the same stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up loop. There are three loops on the hook now. Yarn one hook, pull through the first two loops on the hook. Yarn one hook again and pull through the remaining two loops on the hook. Okay. One double crochet increase is finished. Continue to work 11 more double crochet increases. We need to work two double crochets in each stitch.
Five double crochet increases are done. Please complete seven more double crochet increases in the same way by yourself. Okay, twelve double crochet increases are finished. Then remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the marker stitch. Insert hook into the marker stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up loop through the stitch. Then pull the first loop on the hook through the original loop on the hook. That's one slip stitch. Round two is done. The chain stitch and the slip stitch are not counted into the number of stitches.